Okay, so we are marking where our hooks are going to start. So we need to get the point where the hooks are so that you can go directly here with your first hook. So I got my wood, my bows at Gikomba and they drilled the holes, the holes for me so to make my work easier because I didn't have that drill. And what I'm doing here, and also I spray painted my wood on one side because the, the other side won't be seen. So I decided to spray paint them on only on one side. So what I'm doing is I'm passing the rope on the holes and tying them so that I can get um, what I want and make sure when you're tying this rope don't tie it tightly because you're going to adjust it well when we place them on the wall so make sure your string is just loosened so that you can be able to adjust it while placing it on the wall so you're going to repeat the same process on the other side as the way we did on this one side tying passing the rope through the holes and tying it so that we can go and adjust it on the wall so here are our hooks and we are placing the ropes on the hooks and starting to adjust now we are starting to adjust our our um, shells we are starting to adjust the ropes so that our shells will be stable and stable and well balanced so make sure you check on everything check everything everything and make sure that they are well balanced and after you're done adjusting them make sure you cut the extra ropes down here so that you can have a very neat finishing don't leave the don't leave the extra ropes like that just cut them and make sure everything is neat neatly done yeah now we are done with our shells so something to note when buying your hooks make sure you check the amount of cages they can hold yeah that's important so it's the next day and we are done with our shelves okay and if you're new to this channel my name is christine you are so welcome to team forever 20 please don't forget to click the subscription button and subscribe like this video and comment down below what you think about the shelves if the if this video is of help to you so let's decorate without wasting our time so i'll show you how i made all this so continue watching to the end another day same god oh yeah so let's just decorate our simple simple and but i did this so if you haven't watched a video on how i did this you can watch it and i will leave the link in the description box so make sure you watch it so that you'll get something to decorate your um, to decorate your shelves yeah and this vase i got it from the from my previous plant so i painted it white and put this flower here so i think this would be the best way and i have these bottles i just pre-painted them and you'll see the video there and i also got this one and i pre-painted it gold so let's place it here. Mm -hmm. Like this. Mm 
How does it look? Comment down below. Yeah, and I have these books. These two books. Watch to the end and see how I made them. So make sure you subscribe for more, for more, for more. So you can arrange them the way you want. And here we have our Chanel. Yeah, so I just plugged this from my plant so I can have some little of green here. Oh no. And also this one, you can add some more here. So that's it. That's our today's video. So here is our little background where I'll be taking my videos. So and I'll leave the link to this wall decor on how I did it. So you'll also check the link on this description box and how I did this vest this is my vest I'll also leave the link on the description box so make sure you make sure you like this video and, and don't forget to subscribe please I love you all peace so tell me how my background looks like oh my god this is so beautiful 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 and we have a plant down here our plant i love this frame i love everything 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 here